Hi, you guys. I'm so excited. I'm trying the, what is it? The white hot ranch burrito from Taco Bell. And I got the cheesy Fiesta potatoes because the cheesy Fiesta potatoes is probably my favorite food item of any fast food place ever. In fact, I just got to dig in immediately. It's gold. Look at this. Oh my God. I found out about these from watching Steph Papa's. Queen, queen, thank you. <laughs> I love her. Oh my God. Okay, anyway. Mm. I was so curious because I saw, I love cheesy cordita crunches. And they had a Doritos, what is it? A Doritos Locos one. So let's try this. Mm. Okay, wow. That is delicious. Oh, it's hot. It's hot. I put hot sauce on here, but I don't think I need it. Okay, and here, let's try. Oh, wait, it's the white hot um nacho fry burrito i think that's what it's called okay look at this you guys Oodly -oo. i never get taco bell's um beef because i don't know their beef kind of gives me a stomach ache sometimes And since I, since I switched to their black beans, I haven't gotten that like stomach ache at all. Oh my God. I was going to get a side of nacho fries because like they're back, but cheesy Fiesta potatoes are my favorite potatoes at Taco Bell. But I will say, those nacho fries are so good. Okay, I actually really do like this burrito. It's funny though, because I know the fries are in it, but I can't really like taste them. I mean, obviously the fries are gonna be like soggy when, it, when it's in like a saucy burrito. Mmm, mmm. -hmm. I'm not gonna rate it yet. I'll wait till the, I'll wait till I finish it. This cheesy cordita Doritos Loco Taco. That's really good. Oh my goodness. Do you hear the church bells? <laughs> Somebody on TikTok was like, when you find the Cacho at Pepe girl's yearbook photo. I'm like, babe, send me a copy. When my dad sold our house, he like threw out all this stuff, including all my yearbooks. <laughs> I, I'm sure at the time he asked me, I was like, you can just throw them out. But thinking about it now, I'm like, your books are so much fun to like go through. I kind of wish I had it. Mainly because I want to read what everybody wrote on like the signature pages. Signing yearbooks was like a whole thing back in the day. I mean, I'm sure it still is. Okay, I always do this. I don't know if it's just because my like 
pinky is really small, but whenever I drink anything, I lift my pinky. <laughs> I like I don't know why I think it's because it's small and it can't like you see ah. my friends say that I have gerbil-esque hands <laughs> and they're kind of right because look hee <laughs> hee like they look gerbil-esque I feel like if I was an animal I would either be a gerbil a hamster or a rat or a chinchilla I think I'm gonna give the burrito an 8 out of 10. I don't really know why I'm giving it an 8 out of 10. Because it's really good, but it's not good enough to be perfection. The quesarito, on the other hand, 10 out of 10. That's the like only burrito I'll get at Taco Bell. I would get this again though. Definitely would. But I think the reason I'm giving it an eight out of ten is because you can taste you can taste the nacho fries in it and it's so good. But I don't know, for some reason it doesn't like feel like I'm eating a burrito with fries in it. Even though that's what it is. I don't think that makes any sense what I'm saying, but. <laughs> I give this. Cheesy Gordita Crunch normally for me is a 10 out of 10. I think this is a 10 out of 10. Because with the Doritos logo taco shell, it makes it even better. And it makes it spicier, which is always so fun. It's so crazy how I used to like never eat spicy food. They're coming for me! I say that every time I hear sirens which is all the time when you live in a city. I kind of like that though. I mean, I don't like that like people need help and that's why like ambulances are coming, but I like having a lot of noise around me. Like even in the mornings, have you guys ever seen Friends? I literally am that guy in that episode that when Rachel is at Joey and Chandler's apartment and the guy is like, Morning's here, the morning's here. I am that guy. I open my window in the morning and I'm literally singing all the time. But so are other people on the street, so. I always hear people like screaming at each other. So not exactly singing, but they're making noise. They're making noise. I don't know, quiet kind of scares me. I need like, I need the noise around me. I'm so excited because for dinner, Will is making like this like broccoli cheddar mac and cheese. It sounds so good. I'm so excited. Oh, I meant to put this on my TikTok story. Oh well. I've been trying to utilize TikTok stories like my Instagram stories because I'm banned on Instagram. I honestly have no idea why I'm banned on Instagram because like, I mean, my, like, I don't really post anything inappropriate on Instagram. It's like mainly what I post on TikTok, you know, 
I think it's just people reporting me as per usual. But I'm trying to get it back, so we'll see. I would create another one, but I feel like it's dumb to create a whole other Instagram if I'm just going to like end up getting it back. I don't know if I'm going to be getting it back, but you know what I mean? Like, it's just crazy. Like, I've had that Instagram since like 2011. It's so crazy that it just is gone now, you know? Because I always like looking at like my like archived stories. And I can't do that anymore. It's like a journal. It's like a diary. Like looking at all your memories on Instagram, you know? I always look at my stories like after going out and I watch it all the time and just laugh. But now I don't even have them. I would be less sad if they let me download my data um maybe i should have done that the first because i was banned on instagram once before and they gave it back to me after my appeal but i appealed it like three weeks ago and i still haven't heard anything so here's hoping you guys mm. it's also where like I keep in contact with a lot of people too. Like, I talk to most people on there. Like, you guys, because I'm, I'm banned from sending and receiving messages on TikTok. So, I tell people to like message me on Instagram. But uh, now you guys just have to like email me, I guess. Oh my god. Hopefully, I get it back, you guys. I'll keep you updated. I'm trying to find like a connection. I don't know. I think it's so weird that these social media platforms don't have like a customer service number because these things happen to so many people and there's no way to get in contact to anyone with anyone, you know? Like why? That's so weird. It's like an app that so many people use there should be like some kind of contact number i don't know rather than just submitting an appeal even though the appeal did work for me last time i don't know y'all we shall see yeah i really liked oh my god okay the white hot ranch is, it's so spicy, but I kind of like it. Like I always hate when things say that they're spicy and then it's not actually that spicy, but this ranch is it. Like, like it is spicy. I got nacho cheese to dip in, but they forgot it. Um, like this white hot ranch is actually really good okay the white hot ranch is a 10 out of 10 because it's actually really spicy and that's what i like but the burrito as a whole 8 out of 10. simply delectable oh my god <gasps> so hot my mouth is on fire right now ah. mm -mm -mm. all right i'm kind of full i don't know if i'm gonna finish this I'll take a few more bites. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna finish this because I wanna leave this. Whenever I eat something, I always leave my favorite for last and I only have a few more of those, so. This sauce, man, my mouth is on fire. If I put on this fire sauce, oh my God, I would just start sweating. Last bite. So 
second to last. <laughs> That's Henry in the background. I got him at the zoo a really long time ago and he had like dirt on him. Not like dirt, like I don't know, this like weird substance was on him. So I was like, oh, of course I get like the dirty one. And all these years I've been meaning to give him a nice bath and I haven't. So he's mainly just for show. <laughs> and my other stuffed animals, I actually do like sleep with at night. I'm a big stuffed animal person. I know that's like kind of weird, but whatever you guys, I'm single so let me have it. <laughs> I actually love being single, not gonna lie. I can do my own thing, do what I want. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.